Hello, my name is Joel Ababa, and I'm the Franchise King. That's really the only reason that I would be uh, waving a crown around. Anyway, thank you for joining me for this brief video on defining what a perfect franchise would look like and feel like to you. This is a simple exercise, and I think it'll really save you a lot of money. Get out your trusty notepad. This one is from my mom. The next great idea notepad. And I've actually written down a lot of ideas and actually have implemented a few. Here's what I want you to do. Take your trusty pen or pencil and write down some characteristics of what, now this is kind of, if you could have it, what would a perfect franchise business include? Or, or what would it look like? Or maybe both. For instance, let's say that you have been managing employees as part of your last job I don't know, for five years, six years, and you're just really sick of having 30 or 40 employees underneath you. So you say to yourself, self, if I buy a franchise, I don't really want a lot of employees, maybe a couple, but you know, I really don't want the headache of having 30 or 40 employees. So write it down. I would like a franchise with a low number of employees. Okay. Hopefully you will start to get what I mean here. What else would be a really cool thing to have if you can have a perfect franchise to run and to own. How about something like, you know what? I really like sales, so I wanna make sure that sales is a real huge aspect of what my day-to-day -day activities would be in a franchise. So you write it down. I want a franchise that includes a lot of sales activities. Or the opposite. You know what? I don't want anything to do with trying to persuade people to buy something. You know, I want them to come into my store and they're gonna know kind of what it is and there's not a lot of sales ability needed to sell it. So write down, I would like a franchise where people come in and see me and where I don't have to sell a lot. Maybe a perfect franchise for you would be a franchise that I can make $10,000 a month in within six months. I don't know if it's possible, probably not, but write it down anyway. I wanna make $10,000 in a franchise within six months. That would be a perfect franchise and a perfect situation for me. I want you to really start thinking of what it would take for you to buy a franchise. What would the franchise have to have? What would your role be in the franchise? If you write stuff like this down before you start doing an online search for the perfect franchise, you're gonna save yourself a lot of time. And be really, really specific. I wanna make six figures in my second year in business. Okay, would that be a perfect franchise for you? Yeah, that would be perfect, Joel. I want to make $120,000 a year in my second year in business. If I can find a franchise like that, that would be perfect for me. Are you starting to get what I'm trying to share with you? I hope so. Anyway, if you want to find that perfect franchise, first define what the perfect franchise would look for you. Thanks for watching. I'm the Franchise King, Joel Ababa.